A bad environment can affect humans in so many ways, but chemical pollution, air pollution, climate change, disease causing microbes, and a lack of access to healthcare definitely impedes on human health. Chemical pollution potentially affects every human on earth. We as humans are also exposed to a large number of synthetic chemical pollutants in our daily life. One study I read suggests on average we have over 700 substances in our body that are not part of the natural human body chemistry. Sheesh! So if nature didn't put it there, who did? You might have guessed it, the chemical industry. Many have estimated that around 250 billion tons of chemicals are produced a year and some of that stuff found their way into our bloodstream and organs. And do you think these chemicals have been tested for harmful effects to us? Heck no! Many of these companies probably just do enough tests to fulfill government guidelines. Plus, usually only the test is one chemical at a time. But as I stated earlier, a study suggests we may have up to 700 substances in our bodies. Considering that there's probably about 150,000 man-made chemicals on the market, it is extremely concerning that these combinations of so-called safe chemicals can create a very harmful effect for humans. The effect of the chemical pollution in humans are disturbing and can potentially create reproductive and hormone system disorders, nervous system disorders, abnormal development in children, and cancer. Air pollution is the contamination of air due to the presence of substances in the atmosphere that are harmful to the health of humans and other animals while causing damage to the climate. Pollutants in the air can be gases, solid particles, or liquid droplets. These pollutants can come from natural sources such as wildfires and volcanic eruptions, but they can also come from human activities such as transportation, industrial processes, and energy production. Air pollution can cause respiratory problems, heart disease, stroke, lung cancer, and other health problems. It also can harm plants and can affect the food supply of all. Climate change can affect human health directly and indirectly. Extreme heat waves, rising sea levels, changes in precipitation resulting in floods and droughts, and intense hurricanes can directly cause injury, illness, and even death. Climate change can also impact people's health and well-being by altering the frequency and intensities of extreme weather events and spread of certain pests and disease. Between 2030 and 2050, climate change is expected to cause approximately 250,000 additional deaths per year from things like malnutrition and heat stress. In addition to these direct effects on human health, climate change can also have an indirect effect on human health by affecting the quality of air, food, and water. Climate change can also lead to the displacement of people from their homes due to the natural disasters such as floods or hurricanes. Hopefully, as a human race, we will be willing to accept the fact that these problems exist and strive to find a solution. Because, at least for now, this is the only place all 7 billion of us can reside. If you like content like this, like, share, and subscribe. Have a great day, guys.